It's a sound Roy Graham says he almost never hears. At the tone, please record your message. His daughter, Deidre Silas's phone headed to voicemail. He's not like her. No way. She always said, Mom, I'm going to this place, especially on my days off. Graham and his wife, Bari, are heartbroken over the news. Their oldest daughter, now gone. You know, she'll go get her. She's the finest. She find who they can pick up right away. They can't find. And she, she lost her life on the job. They tell me she had a servant's heart and loved the children she helped each day. Andre Silas is Deidre's husband. He calls her the light of his life, devastated they won't be able to grow old together and watch their children grow up. No matter how hard it was for her, Deidre always did the right thing. She's always made the right choice, even when she didn't want to. Their children are two and five. Silas worries the youngest won't remember her mother as she gets older, and he doesn't want her death to be in vain. There should be preventative measures in place, and if they can't use my wife's example to yes. figure out what they need to do as far as getting that training, getting those protocols in place. Then I don't, what else needs to happen? She's gone. Never gonna come back. No way. No how. 